Well guys, happy day. It's a Sunday, May 25th. I know I said I wasn't gonna vlog, but oh my goodness. Sometimes plans change and you don't have anything to do, so I am bored. But look at all this awesomeness. This is a huge bridge, it goes all the way down there. And I'm just walking on it because YOLO. This bridge makes me feel like I'm on this I'm on a safari in like a faraway land. But no, but it's just Waukesha, <laughs> Wisconsin. But I love it here. I feel like they're gonna be like little monkeys that pop out. Like there's little spider monkeys with wild trash. Some people just have no respect. Like, oh my goodness. That is so rude. Literally cannot even right now. See that lookout point up there? I'm gonna go on that and be like, hey everyone, I'm up here. <gasps> Poachers. They're coming to hide, hunt the tigers and the bald eagles. But they have hair. Oh, there it is. I'm coming for you, baby. Well, hey, I'm not up here because look, <laughs> they got it all part off. <laughs> Why is my life so terrible? I walked 10,000 miles to get to this place. But seriously, it feels like we're in a foreign land. But if you look right over here, see how there's a building behind there? I'm probably gonna go there next, because that's Target. <laughs> I need me some chips. Gorgeous, the way the water is sparkling like fine wine. And all this delightful foliage. I don't know what poison ivy looks like, but if I see it, I'm gonna touch it. Cause you only live once. What is, what is that? I don't know what that is, but it smells like awesome. And I need some. Oh looky, it's the red winged blackbird. You talking smack? But hey, he's my homie cause we're both, we both have red wings. <laughs> oh my goodness, I see people coming up from here from down yonder way. Come here. Come here and love me. Will you be my friends? I'm right here. I'm the man you've been searching for all your life. No? Okay, I guess I'll go jump in the in the ocean right there. Man, you can you can catch some killer waves. Hang ten on them ripples. Well, they were my friends. Okay, not really. I've never met them before, but a couple of them were like two teenage girls. Excuse me, crow. I'm talking. Can you go like caw somewhere else? Ah. Uh, now you made me lose my train of thought, you jerk. Ugh. Oh yeah, they're they're like. <laughs> Can you take a picture of us? And I'm like, <laughs> of course, yes. I actually was kind of enthusiastic about it. I'm like, oh my gosh, yes! <laughs> it was kind of funny. But, but it was just it was just a wonderful experience. I just <sighs> Oh my god, it is so hot out, but I'm over it. I don't usually do stuff on Sundays, it's weird. I usually go to church like two or three times on Sundays. To help with like music or whatever. So now today, I only went to church once this morning, so now I'm just kind of like... Okay. I have to like make my own life now? Well, um... Cool. What do people do once they graduate, like all their schools, and... They're just not kids anymore. I don't understand, like, how do you become an adult? I'll be turning 27 in roughly five weeks, and I still, like, have no idea what I'm doing. They don't teach you how to just live in school. Like, ever since I graduated, like, I graduated from college in 2010, and it is about four years later now, and I've just been lost. Because I've grown up, I've basically grown up 
um, upon everyone else's schedule, I guess. I mean, school ran my life. And, like, my parents ran my life or, like, when I was a child. And now that there's no more school and that I'm, like, I'm my own man, I just feel like, oh, what do I do with myself now? I don't know what to do. There's no one telling me what I need to do. And it's just... <laughs> It's, it's scary. I don't know what to do. I feel so stupid. Every day I wake up and it's like, uh, well, um, I guess I'm gonna go eat some cereal and I'm gonna go shopping. <laughs> no, I don't know. It's like, I need a job, like a real job, but I don't know what to do because I don't know what my talents are. I don't know what my gift. I don't know what I can do. I mean, like, as far as things are. Because, like, yeah, I'm tal talented in, like, music and art and stuff like that. But that stuff really doesn't make that much that money. <laughs> Unless, like, you're famous. A celebrity. But, like, I don't think I'm that top-notch quality. And, it's, plus, it just doesn't come easy. I mean, what do I do in the meantime if that ever were to be a thing? I mean, like, I don't really want to be, like, famous. Because, like, there are a lot of people out there who seek um, fame and fortune. But, like, fortune... I don't really want fortune. I just want to be financially okay. I don't want, like, excessive gaudy things and just I don't know if money would go to my head or not <laughs> but fame fame just seems annoying to me especially like people always in your face and there it's just having fans is just kind of shady not shady that's not the word I don't even know what that word means it's I mean, when you're an introvert like I am, being surrounded by a lot of people, especially when, like, the attention's all on you, that's very unnerving. <laughs> and that would give me panic attacks and anxiety, and I just I just can't put up with that crud in my life. Because I've dealt with it for so long, and, like, I just don't want that kind of lifestyle. Just give me your money and stay away. <laughs> I'm such a jerk, but... That's what fear does to you. Or like anxiety does to you. It just, it turns you into a big person. Wow, I look really bright. I don't know what I'm talking about now. I'm just sitting in my house alone, wondering, like just contemplating the, 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 the pressures of life. Oh, first world pains are just so difficult. I'm gonna go open up my my million dollar, I don't know. I'm just being sassy, but I don't know. Some days you just gotta be like, girl, I need me some ice creams. And then you eat your ice creams. So delicious dairy-free coconut cookie dough. That is my stuff. I rollerbladed a little over four miles. I completed my my circuit. I did that circuit well, almost completely once on foot, just walking, and that took forever. But it was pouring rain that day.